Could you kindly start this show off? Turn that thing down and get ready for school. I told you, you're going to school. Earache or whatever. <laughs> Everybody out there, time to get live, time to get vertical. It's time for morning coffee. Time to get your groove on, get your move on. It's a special day in the house. Really? Tell me yeah. about it. Deanna Hodges, the entrepreneur. Bam. It's going to be fun, y'all. Hey. You know something, you guys? We got something going on here. We're going to try to walk with class today. I know it's a hard day, but when you have a VIP in the room, you need to lean left, lean right, get your shirt tight, make sure you got the right shoes on because she's going to sit back and scale you down and let you know if you're rolling with some swag. Mario, are you rolling with swag? Man, I'm rolling with swag. Sure. It's going to be a wonderful day in the neighborhood. If you say so. Time to get inspired. Those of us who've been sitting around too long doing nothing, <laughs> you'll get busy now. <laughs> and let me tell you guys, I hope we can get to the other segments, but my, my, my whole point of this is that I prepare for hot picks and new new sports, but I think once we get into the story of Deanna Hodges, we will find out that this woman is more than what you think she is. I, I, I'm going to say this, E-woman, the woman designer, Mark, yes. all you can hope for, right, man? That's right. And let me just say this. If I sit here and tell you I'm about to learn about how hard somebody works, I don't know how she does it, but I'm going to keep it a secret for right now, Mark. So in the meantime, all I'm going to say is this. I bow my head to you. You are unbelievable. Adrian Anderson, thank you so much. Yeah. You guys are wonderful women. Mario, can you trump that? No. So everybody get your stretch on. You know how we say it, Morning Coffee, you got to have that minute to get your stretch on, get your groove on. So whatever you're having this morning, whatever you're sipping on, if you got your bran muffin, your yogurt, your fresh fruit, or if you're smoking those unfiltered camels, oh, no. those illegal Cubans, no. that badass Cali, whatever you're sipping on, whatever you're smoking this morning, come on and share it with us. Hey, I got something for you. All I know is this. You guys will probably find out that there is sports mixed with fashion. And if we're allowed the time to share this moment with Deanna, we're going to find out how she feels about fashion sports. I'm only giving you a hint. But in the meantime, Mario, people have to understand this is the longest intro in Internet history. We actually like to talk a lot, don't we? We like you to get that moment because we know you are asleep. <laughs> we know what you look like sitting around out there in your PJs. <laughs> Yeah, get a shower this morning. That's wrong. Mario, you think you're the hardest working man in show business? Hey. Well, you've been trumped because somebody's in the room here is going to actually challenge you for that title. But in the meantime, let's, let's just do what we, we came, came to, to do. do. Oh, man, Come on. I, I love this part because it's almost over, right? Come on, <laughs> everyone, be cool. You know something? I, I really believe that um, you're going to try to talk about how much work you do. But I'm going you know, to I'll let you know that you really are about to take second fiddle today. Well, I, well, you know what? They used to say that James Brown was the hardest working man in show business. But, you know, in our world of entrepreneurism, especially like in the world of Internet television and so many other folks doing this. Right. We've learned this is a, you know, full time, overtime, all the time kind of a thing. And so but the rewards are there. And we're going to get a chance to talk about that again today, too. So we do. We have in our studio today, everybody, let me get my claps ready. <laughs> you better get them right. <laughs> Deanna Hodges. Yes, sir. Entrepreneur, <laughs> the Hodges Collection. Man. You're going to get a chance to meet and greet with her. She's going to tell us about the things that she's been doing. Yeah. And, again, we think you're going to find that this story is one that is inspiring. Yes. And her time is valuable, Mario, so you really don't waste it. Well, you know. Okay. I'm, you know how I am. Yeah. You got to respect the beauty. Yes. Can charisma. <laughs> okay. And here with the old man. <laughs> I know. Okay. All right. It's Wednesday, July 10th, 2013. And every week we have a weekly quotation. This week is no different. This week the quotation is from none other than George Bernard Shaw. And I quote, A life spent making mistakes is not only more honorable, but more useful than a life spent doing nothing. Very good, man. I like okay. that. So, yeah, there you go. She agrees, too. Oh, yeah. yeah. I, I kind of like that. There she goes. And you know what, Mario? Can you wear the color she wear and have that impact? You know, you, I, you, in Los Angeles, you can wear certain colors and track different companies. <laughs> <laughs> this is 
eggplant. Which is all cool. <laughs> I think you could totally pull it off. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about the pink stripes. But you know, we got eggplant. friends of all, all you know. <laughs> hey, you know what? You know, I, I'm, I'm going to say this. We're, we're supposed to be really official and everything. I just love her accent, man. I Man. Well, I'll tell you, this, this, the, the wonderful warmth of the South <laughs> oh, I know. will be exhibited here today. Uh, all right, all right. And so, do, do now, Vic, yes. in terms of what now for you t- this morning, right? Uh, are we going to be having the new new sports? I prepared for them just in case. But and the hot picks? And the hot picks. Okay. And, and, and especially in a different way, not what you think, but I prepared if we have time because you know when the story gets rolling here. You may not have time, you know. Adrian's coming in the in here, so there's going to be a twofer going on here today. So we're going to find out how fashion rolls, Morris. So I, okay, I prepared it. I want to acknowledge the chat room too, all the way from around the globe. A motley crew. First of all, GNM bureau chief Mac McAllister from Port Townsend, Washington. <laughs> Seventy-three years young. That's and just doing a, his thing. That's just a rumor. He's just a rumor. Yeah. And from Pittsburgh, we have P- PMC, a.k.a. Philip Cusper, the Beatmaster. There you go. There you musical go. mind. Part of the collab project. So it's one of those, and Vic, now we do have today, we were also going to show right. at some time today uh, a video, for another, re- another video from the recent collection that you shot here. Oh, okay. At any time of the day, you like to show that. And, uh, you know, you have already had your internal ratings. You know, we're not going to tell anybody because you rated the video already and the performance. So we'll just keep that kind of secret right now. But I can't wait for it. But, you know, be, don't be teasing people, man. Well, we won't tease you. All so right. I'll tell you what. Like always, we love to give you those wonderful musical interludes. We're going to give you one right now uh, by none other than Lord Buffalo. From the recent South by Southwest uh, musical conference in Austin, Texas, which was a wonder. Okay. Uh, this everybody's been talking about this, even the old school folks, because they say it reminds them of the Doors, Vic. Uh, Z- uh, Led Zeppelin. <laughs> I'm just going. And then we'll get, we'll be back and get to spend some time with our guest, Deanna Hodges. We'll be right back. All day. Thank you. 